What's up everybody? Headed to take Clyde to get an alignment. So I'm gonna hop in, run him over there. I guess I don't need that sitting in there right now because it's not bolting in. Gotta still get the bolts in there. Even though I don't think it would come out. If I was driving, but yep. So we're gonna take Clyde over, get an alignment on it. Still got a bunch of stuff to finish up, but trying to work it into what works best for everybody so we can get a alignment on this thing. The car's also got a weird wind driving down the highway, so got to get some new rear gears. That'll be going back to Rick here early in the week once he gets some gears in. Uh, but yeah, that's it, guys. Simple little video today. Going to run you over there. Should be a simple uh, alignment on the car, too, because there's only, like, one adjustment we can even make. And drive-by wire throttle's kind of touchy. <laughs> but uh, this will be probably a... Well, about 15 20 minute drive each way so it'll be a good little uh, cruise I did about that yesterday as well so uh, just putting some miles on the car seeing what it does and uh, trying to work out all the little bugs or figure out what I need to work on tune wise and all that stuff so that's it guys so we're getting it all lined out see how uh, close my garage alignment is I know it's a little off because the steering wheel is crooked as I was driving but we'll see what it does okay nice and slow okay record it. So here's the wheelbase, guys. 97.2, and it's perfect side to side. Well, 0.3, close enough. We'll take it. Rick, would you explain kind of what we got? 0, 0.00 inches setback on the left front. It's perfectly square. We got a a tenth of a degree setback on the uh, the left rear. Uh, my lateral offset is 1.3, 1.5. Uh, it's this car is about as square as it gets, to be honest. Not yeah. bad for a 72. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. We'll go back to the, <clears throat> that screen right there in the degrees. And uh, yeah, four hundredths of a degree setback on the right front and uh, 13 hundredths on the left rear. Uh, 1.65 degree track with difference. It's, uh, so we did a little bit on the front, mostly straight in the wheel. and That's perfect. Pretty much where we're at. It's perfect. Heck yeah, awesome. Awesome. Thanks, Rick. Yeah. All right, guys. So heading actually to Alex's house. He met me over there at Brakemore's. Uh, shout out to Rick and those guys. They always uh, take care of the cars that we build and knock out the alignments and make sure everything's safe and true and good and all that. So I'm uh, going to meet up with Alex. Going to take him for a little ride in the car since he hasn't been able to ride in it yet. Uh, and all the help that he's done on it. So definitely want to let him enjoy it some too. So Everything's working pretty good. Um, it does come down and idle. See how it like drops to 400 and something, 400, 300, 90. It, it idles pretty terrible, so it definitely needs cleaned up at idle. Um, 150 degree water temp and all that. So uh, once it idles, it's good, like 600 above, but for some reason right there at idle, it wants to idle real low. So that's some stuff that I can work on in the tune, get it cleaned up. All right, so here's a good uh, example of how big the car is. There's the Mazda. And there's a Mini Cooper. So they're not a huge amount of difference in size. <laughs> so Alex just got done driving it. What'd you think? Uh, it runs. Runs pretty good, drives yeah, pretty good. Uh, so we did we did a I decent expected. job on it. So uh, we'll do a lot more of that, but uh, just took him for, let him drive around the block real quick so he can check it out and see what's up and have some fun with it now that we're half working on it. Kind of. Yeah. Still plenty of stuff to do, but the, the major stuff's done. All right, so car's back home. All's good on the alignment. Everything's running pretty decent. Uh, just chipping away at the little things now. So, All right, guys, thanks for watching. I appreciate everybody. If you have not yet, please hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you next time. Just drive.